There's 1,300 freshmen in the freshman class, so probably about 75% of them will come in today. Where are you from? Austin, Texas. Uh, I'm from New York. I'm from Black River, New York. <laughs> from Rhode Island. Uh, Fair Beach, Florida. Where are you from? Um, just south of Buffalo, New York. From Ithaca, New York. We live in Massachusetts. Uh, Northern Virginia, Herndon. Um, LA, California. What's the weirdest thing you brought from home? Uh, the weirdest thing I brought with me... Um, Mexican chili powder that I sprinkle on my fruit. Violin, probably. My cactus. <laughs> oh, those are really pretty. Oh, I drew a brain to put in my dorm room because I'm majoring <laughs> in brain and cognitive sciences. <laughs> uh, I brought a little... a little coaster for my favorite taco place. Plants aren't weird, are they? Yeah, I brought these plants. <laughs> Jumper cables, because they were in the trunk. Uh, this one is Jeremiah, and this one is Jeffrey. We tried to downplay her weird. Yeah. <laughs> she was packing. How often do you plan on contacting your family? Mm, maybe like once a week. A little bit. <laughs> Not much, really. A couple times a month. <laughs> Probably once a week. Uh, every day. Maybe every day, every other day. Um, at least multiple times a week. At least, you know, at the beginning we figure out what works for us. Probably would want me to call them like every five minutes if possible, but I don't know, maybe a few times during the week. How often do you want your student to contact you? Twice a week. <laughs> every day. <laughs> Whatever she is comfortable with. I'm planning to move in and start studying myself. <laughs> I wish she called me at least daily. <laughs> Once. Every day. Every yes. day is correct. But three times a week will make me very happy. I don't know how it happened. We took the floor and she said, Dot. Oh, don't you da 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 we're selling plants for the pep band um, to keep in their dorm room through their freshman year. Um, a lot of our members actually have had their plants, um, they're on their third or fourth year. They've survived a pretty long time. So this is stop and shop, so in the spring when everyone leaves, we have the upperclassmen drop off things they don't want anymore at different locations, which is called dump and run, and then we store it over the summer and sell it back to freshmen. So it's just all about reusing things and not sort of throwing them out. I am getting this lovely bin here. This will be for all of my excess things that I don't have anywhere to put right now. <laughs> So these are the shirts that we give out to all the students that come through the expo. We design a new shirt each year. It's available only one day a year. So there's groups from all over. Uh, dining services, we're from University IT. Uh, there's Wilson Commons, a lot of the student groups are here. They're officially becoming a member of their class. The parents are going off to a barbecue and then the students go and eat with their RA, their first kind of parting of the ways. What will you miss the most about your students? Just talking to her. She makes me laugh. Finding things. Everything that's missing, he can find it. <laughs> yeah, you know he's in the basement uh, doing his own stuff. I know he's there. But now, oh. Uh, she makes us everyday happy. Um, she plays with my daughter, with her sisters. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> her energy at home, I think her positive energy and uh, I don't know, just, yeah. And just having her part of her family and her jokes and yeah. A production of the University of Rochester. Please visit us online and subscribe to our channel for more videos.